Hi all guys, uh, so here we are with uh, hackthisco.uk This is a site for hackers like you uh, get pretty much a practice ground to learn hacking and uh, for the security certification and security others Okay, this is the first uh, part of uh, the first chapter of uh, hackthisco.uk and uh, that's the main you can go here to the site here I'll leave this uh, link on the uh, description of this video okay let's try to hack this level okay uh in this level uh what you see it rewards like uh, 20 points uh, 10 points sorry and uh, it's main level one and it clearly specified do not enter your credentials here below and if you get stuck you can uh, always click on show hint button here so if you click here now it says okay Okay, fine. So let's try to uh, crack this chapter now. As it says, uh, what I'll be doing is first I'll enter some random username and random password here and see what happens. Okay, it says invalid details. Let's uh, try with some like something like no username and no password, and what it says is. Uh, again an invalid password so let's jump into the code and how it's written here and uh, we'll find out what's the what should be the username and password for this and how to crack this level so this is an elementary level and we are going through the backend codes I see a lot of comments here done and uh, I don't see pretty much of things here memory so code okay let's see here okay main one okay level one web icon no let's see things are getting loaded up here uh, let's see the URL will press command U for this view source page and it doesn't allow okay now we see the source is uh, loaded here uh, let's go and see okay you see one line here saying username and password are uh, embedded in the code itself so we'll try the username is in and password is out so let's try that out now in and out and voila we have uh, cracked this level okay so and here is some thing to learn here that we should not ever embed our credentials into the uh, uh, we should not embed our credentials in our codes that we are that's been exposed on the client side okay let's move on to the next level and we will see that in the next video thanks for watching please do subscribe